okay so in this demo I'm quickly going to show, us, uh, show you how you can use X-Ways Forensics to very quickly and easily resolve the uh, Windows SSIDs to the actual usernames of the machine. Um, I'm going to show you the uh, long way first, long in inverted commas because it's not actually that long and then I'm going to show you the really easy way to do it. Um, so I've just created a quick case, I'm going to add an image to it choose this NTFS image and now uh, the quick way of finding registry files in XY forensics uh, which is obviously what we need to do job is on the type filter if we click the funnel uh, it comes up with the type dialog for which there's various bits and pieces in here which we can choose but there's actually a, uh, a category already as you can see called Windows registry if we tick that box it will list all files that are to do with the Windows registry or we can choose specific ones uh, now obviously for what we want to do we actually only need the SAM file um, but just for the purposes of demonstration I'm just going to leave all of them ticked select activate and then a right click to recursively explore so it will list all the files from this particular partition that are a registry type file and here are the files uh, now within XY Forensics it's got its own built in registry viewer if you if you double click a registry file it will launch the registry viewer so if I just click the SAM file it comes up with the registry viewer software and uh, we explore our way through here you've got accounts in there, users in there and then you've got names down here and here are all the names of the users of that machine so you could just then do a screenshot of that um, uh, or whatever you like. Um, you can also create a report from it if you wish. Um, and it will save it. Uh, it I'm not going to bother doing it because it's fairly self Um Or what you could also do is export the list. Um, just quickly do this just to show you. It defaults it to a HTML file. and I think it will launch Firefox in a minute forgive me now it doesn't actually launch Firefox automatically uh, but it creates, creates the text file in the root of your case uh, demo which you can then double click to look at in notepad or whatever um, and as you, can do it, as you can see it resolves quite a lot of the information but an easier way still is to not use the registry viewer at all. Within XWAYS Forensics itself, uh, you've obviously got your case there and all the uh, forensic images that you've added in. Now, in this case, I've only got the one, but I could equally have had five, ten, a hundred cases in here, a uh, hundred forensic images in here, uh, and the theory would still be the same. All you have to do is right click the case. Uh, uh, root right at the top right click properties and it comes up with this properties box and you'll notice at the bottom there there's a button called SIDS if we click that button it very quickly just shows you there uh, the IDs to the user profiles which as you remember from the registry viewer was what I just showed you in the registry viewer um, and if there were a dozen forensic images in here it would separate out uh, with separate lines to say you know forensic image one, forensic image two, and so on. So you can then just copy and paste all of that if you want um, into a report or uh, a word processing file or whatever. So that's it. Is that? Uh, the, I'm not entirely sure why uh, the X-rays guys chose to put it as like an overarching case thing as opposed to a per forensic image thing. Uh, I assume they expect if you want to do it on a per image basis that you would do it via the registry directly whereas if you just want a quick overview of all the SIDs to do with the case then you just tick, click that button there simple as that